What's up? We have a special treat for you today. We are going to be flipping a piece of furniture to make it look like a more expensive piece of furniture. Basically, what we've done is we have found this expensive piece of furniture on Pinterest. Pinterest, it looks like it's about $2,000. $2,000 and what we're gonna do is we have found this on Facebook Marketplace for 75, but 75. I negotiated to 60. That's a deal. 15 buckaroonies off. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna try to flip it to make it look like this $2,000 one and it probably won't look anything like it, but we will try. It will look amazing. And we will see how it turns out and... It's gonna go in our kitchen. It's gonna go in our kitchen and if it doesn't look good, then maybe we'll sell it. Yeah, that too. <laughs> so we're gonna go pick that up. It's so bright. You got it? Yeah, I got it. All by my lonesome. <laughs> There's spider eggs in there too. No, I don't like that. Hi, welcome to our show. Day two. Oh. So, we picked up this lovely cabinet yesterday, and if you're ready for the big reveal, here it is. This is to make it look like this really expensive, nice one on this website that we found. And we're just gonna restore it and make it look real nice. And maybe we will flip it and maybe we will keep it. But we will probably keep it. Probably keep it. I'm like seriously so excited about this one. There's this empty space in our kitchen and I'm hoping that it will go in there perfectly. But it did come from a smoker house, so it stinks right now. I'm gonna clean it up, we're gonna paint it, and we also are gonna put new legs on it so it's a little bit taller. And I gotta go back to work. Bye! Bye! We'll be out periodically to help. All right, I gathered up a few supplies, um, some fantastic, cause it's fantastic. <laughs> some glass cleaner to clean the glass, and some wood cleaner. Only have a little bit left, so we'll see how that goes, but I'm just gonna wipe up everything. Hey, it's me up here. I'll show. Hey. I still get to hang out with Cam. It's me, I'm in my office. In your office? I'm in my office doing stuff. Basil, what do you think? Basil. <laughs> painting it with our paint sprayer, I think. So I'm gonna go ahead and take off like all the hardware. I'm gonna pop the glass out and then we'll just put it back on with silicone. And then um, I also think we're gonna saw off the legs to put on new legs and make it a little bit bigger. So I will need Cam's help for that. Okay, I'm not sure if you guys can see this, but I wanna take off this 
piece up top and I can see the screws in it so, so hopefully it's super easy. We'll see. And that's what I was afraid of. I just broke the glass. <sighs> figure it out. We'll figure it out. Painter? Painter boy. Halfway through. Well, wow, that's ah, a great spot for the camera so right bright. in the sun. <laughs> First coat is done and I can't see a thing. Um, there's a car coming and I hate filming when there's cars, so I'm just gonna pretend like I'm not looking at the camera. We're just taking a picture. Honestly, having a paint sprayer is super nice because we've done one coat and I don't think we'll need another one because yeah. it looks extremely good. Uh, the coverage is awesome. So. So yeah, uh, we'll probably like just go through and touch up one more time with the paint sprayer, but we have to flip the doors and the shelves over just to finish that other side. It's looking good. Really good. I'm so excited. Bye now. For now. For now. For now, bye. What you doing? So we got new glass and I am just putting silicone around it so that it stays in. Sorry, this thing is so loud right here. We have finished the doors and I'm talking really loud just in case you can't hear me over the air conditioner. We've clogged them and they are looking spiffy. As 
you can see. Absolutely spiffy. We got the other one over here. So at this point, we are waiting on the legs to get here. And once the legs get here, then we'll put those on and then we will put the doors back on and we will decorate with our decor. this and to have it in our kitchen and we're gonna go over the total cost for it. Oh. Yeah! <laughs> Promise these are all our dogs. <laughs> we're babysitting two dogs right now. So the individual expenses for this project was, first off, this for? $60. The cabinet was $60. Next was for these legs, which they're here behind me. The legs were $60. We got them off of Amazon and that one was a little bit of a splurge just because we needed them to be this exact size or else they wouldn't work. Next expense was the broken glass. So the replacement piece was 40? Yeah, $40. Yeah, I just went to like a local glass place here in the area and I called them, gave them the dimensions and they had the new piece ready for me within a day. So that brings our total cost for this project to 160 which isn't bad for this butte right here. I will also add that all the decorations that you see in it, um, we either had, like we had a picture frame, we had like two vases, but everything else I bought at Goodwill for a total of $20. So if you wanna add that in there, I guess the total for decorations and the thing would be one eight. So like we said, we are gonna keep this for our home just because it fits here. But we did look at some comparables on like Facebook Marketplace and stuff. And similar ones to this are going anywhere from like 350 to 400. So we estimate that we could have sold it for that if we were flipping it. So that wouldn't have been a bad profit. However, it was quite a bit of work putting the legs on and painting it. So is it worth that? I don't know. Maybe. I feel like if we were actually flipping it for profit that we wouldn't have put quite as much money into it. We would have gone with cheaper legs, I don't know, maybe done something different besides getting new glass like putting burlap in there or something that would be a little bit cheaper. Anyways, hopefully y'all enjoyed this video and please touch the buttons below. Bye!